This is Nick with Build Brothers Roofing at 3886 Alfie Lane out here in Carl's Best. Started my digital inspection uh, on top of this asphalt shingle roof. And we always like to start underneath the eaves of the house. The eaves of the home will consist of your fascia board, uh, you have your rafter tails, and then you have your starter board. And the reason why we like to start underneath the eave is that it gives us a really good idea about what kind of wood damage we can expect on this property. It shows us how, how good of a job the roof is doing as far as you know keeping water off the property as well. But you can see we do have some wood rot going on over here in this corner. Um, this house was just recently painted, so you know a lot of bondo was used to kind of seal off some of this bad wood. So hopefully that does help. Um, but we can see that there have been some termite damage in the past, has been some termite damage in the past as well, as we can see. So there will be some wood repair on this project. Um, but because they did replace, looks like they replaced some of the fascia board um, and it looks like they painted everything over. So, you know, I don't see the wood repair getting too extensive on this property. Now, going to the, pro the shingle product itself, this right off the bat, we can see how much granule loss has started to occur on this property. So if I scoot back over here, you can see how shiny it is with the, sh the sun shining against it. And essentially what's happening is the oils on this asphalt shingle have started to evaporate. And as those oils evaporate, the granules start to deplete and all this fiberglass becomes begins to be exposed. Um, once that starts to occur, occur, it's a telltale sign that the product has gone past its life expectancy. Uh, I wanna point something out over here on this section also. We can see that there's no gutters on this home. And we can also see just how worn out this whole section is. So what's happening is as that water just flows off this roof, it's been hitting this portion of the roof for quite some time and all the granules have completely depleted off of this product. You can see this stuff is literally just starting to crumble right now. Um, it's really just starting to come apart. And all those granules end up in the gutters down on this section. So these are all the granules from the roof itself. You can see how much, how much that is. Um, you can also see just how loose this product is. Um, again, you can see where all the damage is starting to occur. Um, once you start to see how loose it is too, I always look to see if the nails are rusted. And if you can see rust underneath the, the shingle, then that means that water is getting underneath it as well. So this product has gone past its life expectancy. Um, you can see that they came around and they sealed off some of these penetrations with some mastic. Uh, those are temporary fixes. So my suggestion based off the condition of this roof uh, is to go ahead and replace it. You can see all the discoloration. We've had some shingle repairs in the past down here, over here. Uh, you can see all the discoloration over here. That's a whole new patch right there also. So again, these are all signs the product has gone well past its life expectancy. So um, in my professional opinion, it is time to replace this roof. Uh, what we want to do is tear this thing down to the wood decking. Once we tear this down to the wood decking, we are going to go ahead and address any of the bad wood that's underneath it. Um, once we go ahead and replace that bad wood, we will then install a layer of the synthetic underlayment or an Owens Corning preferred contractor. Um, so that underlayment will come with a 50 year warranty from Owens Corning. We're gonna need to go ahead and seal off this penetration. This looks like a new one. And you can see how water and moisture will just get right down in there too. Um, so we can seal that off also for the customer. Anyway, back to the roof. Um, brand new synthetic underlayment, 50 year warranty from them. We're gonna go ahead and add starter shingle along the entire perimeter of the roof. We will then go ahead and install the drip edge. Drip edge is this piece of metal right here. Uh, this drip edge allows water to run off the, the, the metal itself as opposed to running down the wood, which will help protect this wood in the future. So brand new drip edge. And then the actual roofing shingle goes right on top of that. Um, the Owens Corning roof will come with a 50 year warranty. Like I said, uh, we're gonna go ahead and increase the exhaust ventilation on this roof also right now. There doesn't seem to be a whole lot of exhaust ventilation. So I want to add at least a couple exhaust vents over here on this side and on this roof plane as well, just to increase that airflow. It's going to help protect the roof, keep it nice and cool. This is up. The homeowner also has the opportunity to upgrade to our duration roofing system, where we would then turn this entire ridge line along with that ridge line into an exhaust ventilation system with ridge vents. Uh, and then we would use some upgraded underlayment on this property as well. But just based off my inspection, based off the condition of the roof, based off the amount of granule loss um, and the age of the product, uh, yeah, it is time to go ahead and replace this shingle product. That's it for my inspection.